This is Susan Hamilton, the Richardson Copywriter, and I wanted to tell you a little bit more about directory listings to get you familiar with these. One thing I wanted you to know uh, is that one listing often pulls into another and pulls into another and pulls into another. It's yet another reason why you need to make absolutely sure that you're listed accurately inside these directories because if it's getting pulled in, uh, you know, if, it, if everything's great, if everything pulls from one location to the next to the next and it's, it all looks good, that's good for you. That's a bunch of links that were pretty easy to, to come by. But if they are inaccurate or if they pull into an area that doesn't quite pull the same information where now it looks funny, uh, that can be problematic. So you need to make sure that not only is the one area claimed, but the next area is claimed, and the next area is claimed, and the next area is claimed. So go ahead and get your eyeballs around that directory and see what the, those affiliations are. Click on those links and just see where else you ended up when you listed with that company. And uh, make sure that's right. And I want to add one more thing to you, uh, to this about uh, your images. Um, you can't always control what images they have about you online if you have not claimed your listing. It's really the only way to do that. If, if, if for some reason this directory has associated an image with your company that has nothing to do with it and you don't claim it, it can be an unsavory image or an unflattering image or an, have an Im, something that has absolutely nothing to do with your company. Um, that can be associated with your business out there and you don't want anything that's going to cause any reader, searcher, viewer to take one look at it and go, I just don't know about that one and choose someone else because of that. So make sure that you make a good uh, use of that image area. Claim your listing or you can't change it. You can Once you claim that listing, you can delete uh, poor images and you can add better ones. You can add your, your the face of your company, your company trucks, your logo, your brands, your product lines and it can be a lot more helpful to you. So just know those two things there. You need to make sure that you know uh, that one directory links to another directory, links to another directory very often, not all the time, but very often. So you need to not only check where you, where you are in the one location, but you need to check how you look in the next location and the next location and follow that on through and if you have to correct something uh, do, do what you have to do to correct it to, to be accurate. Sometimes you just as simple as going back to the very root directory and fixing that and also make sure that your images are loaded properly. You may have to upload images and claim them in each particular directory that's associated together but it's worth that time and effort to do that so, if you, so that any links that go back to your website uh, are really benefiting you. You don't want anything to go back there that, that pulls away or takes away because it's one thing to have those links out there. Well, that's good for search engines, but you're also after real, live, warm human beings. So this is Susan Hamilton, the Richardson Copywriter, and I'm going to share some more with you about directory listings in our next video. Thank you.